Welcome back into Twin Cities Live. So this spring, we've had lots of rain. Mm -hmm. We've also had lots of sunshine, which is nice. And everything is turning green around Minnesota. For most homeowners, though, that means the weeds are here, too. Okay, Mike Fratelloni is here with some tools to help you make sure your summer of 2024 is not the summer of weeds. Hi, Mikey Frat. It, it is the summer of weeds. Okay. All right, we just got to get rid of it. Yeah, yeah, right? yeah. We got it's your... it's kind of crazy. But this is like, you're not talking about spraying this stuff down with all this toxic business. This you're, is all chemical free. You're just getting down and yeah, dirty with this it. This is like a little work. elbow grease. Yeah, this like is what this. you send the kids out. I've been sending my kids out with a bucket, a five gallon bucket, and I say, fill it up and come back. And they're not barely doing it, but <laughs> at least I talk yeah. to them. I start talking. Is there a monetary incentive, or no, you just say, like, just no, go out and do it get, because that's your chore? They get to eat. And they get to That's, do stuff yes, at the house, yes, right? Yeah, good so, for you. Where do you want good to start? You. you got a bunch of stuff. So I do have, you know, everyone's seen these tools, right, where you dig into the weeds and you, you, you know, pry the weed out. Yeah. yeah. Right, and that's a hands and knees kind of thing, Yeah, right? yeah, yeah. And we, we've invented some new things since then. Like Corona comes out with this beautiful weeder. You stand tall and do it, right? Okay. Same thing at the end, but you can stand up and just do it, right? Yeah, take it's care way, of your back way, way your knees. That's really it's nice. A, it's a very, very cool thing. But I have something that's a couple steps better than that. Okay, what's and that? And we call this the weed, the weasel weed popper, right? Let me, I'm going to put this down on the ground. I'm going to show you how this one works. Oh. Okay, so let me put my weeds down here. Mm -hmm. Here, I'll hand you this. Thank you. And mm -hmm. this weed popper, let me pop this little thing off. I forgot to do that beforehand. That's okay. It, it pops really oh, cool, oh. right? So you jam hmm. this, the teeth down into the weed and you give it a little spin and I don't know how great that's going to work yeah, with the dirt in here. Yeah, because it's Oh my gosh. And you see that, grab that and then it pulls out the weed and then watch. Okay. No, well, that can't work here. It's <laughs> good. No, yeah, but see, it pops weed. Then you'd put it in the bucket. You wouldn't do it on the show floor here. No, you would right. put it right into the bucket. You would. But I have a broom for that. I like that. <laughs> I think that's really sweet. Because so, you want to get down into the root system of the weed, right? You can actually see there's some teeth here, right? So I'll hold this still. There's some teeth and then a little gap. So as you spin it clockwise, it grabs the root and the weed. Mm -hmm. And then you pull it up and then hit that pop button. And it makes the floor super dirty, but the weed jumps into and the we're bucket, done. right? Yeah. It's yeah. super cool. If you want to have, uh, you, you have boys or girls? I have a girl and two boys. Uh, two boys, are they getting around like 13 years yeah, old? Yeah, yeah, like one that's 13 yet? right now. Mm -hmm. Okay, of course. Okay, yeah. so this is, the, this is the cool for the, the, yeah, we are. It's just a thing. So I like this one too. This one is my personal unit. You t it puts a little gas tank on here, okay. right? You yeah. can use this to start your bonfire. You can use this to melt snow outside. I, I have two of those. You have two of those. Okay. <laughs> so this I one, love you, these two so much. You turn it on. You can hear the gas. There's a little igniter right here. And oh, you can see that, right? You see that yeah. blue? And then you just go around and you burn. You don't have to, like, light them necessarily on fire. Yeah, because you don't want to start a fire in your yard. No, but right now everything's so wet, yeah. right? Yeah. Okay. You just hit the weed. And it starts to, you can see it start to melt, but you barely need to do it because as you do it, that heat alone kills the plant, oh. right? So you don't have to, I'm going to shut it off, you don't have to light everything on fire. You just have to make the weed really hot for like five seconds and it dies. That's yeah. nice though because that thing is really small, like without the tank on there to oh. store it. Oh yeah, really it's small. It's, it's super yeah. light. You can get into your perennial gardens like this so yeah. you don't have to worry about killing something else. You can get really specific where you're going. Obviously, as we dry out during the season, be more cautious. Right. It. You don't want it to light up everything. But, I mean, around your gardens, in your driveway, where you have grass growing up through the driveway, uh -huh. mm -hmm. you know, that's really hard to get with any tool. You walk over with this, kick it on, walk over there, burn some stuff. If you have a cigar, you can light your cigar <laughs> and then do it. If I you mean, burn think of it that. and then poured water over it, would that be fine? Yeah, but why would you do that? Yeah, well, because it's, if you didn't want everything else to start on fire. Oh, yeah, but nothing really starts on fire. Yeah, because you don't really have to heat. blast it, right, blast I'm just it. making yeah, sure. Yeah. yeah, and if you've got rocks and stuff, you've got weeds going through the rocks, it's, it's perfect. It's a that. perfect thing to do. Yeah, yeah, and, yeah. It, and it's really clean looking. It's no chemicals. I like the fact it's no chemicals. I know, I like that. We too. do have the big round of chemicals, but a lot of people enjoy the uh, low chemicals. Now, in your gardens where you're getting weeds, right, there are tools where you just see people use shovels or hard rakes. But we have this, like, garden weasel type thing. It's made by True Temper. Everyone heard of the garden weasel before. Mm -hmm. The reason why those are so ubiquitous, they're all over the place, because they super work. So what do they you do? Really roll work. it over? You just roll it back and forth, and it rips whatever you have out, right? So it's like a tiller for your gardens. Yeah. And it works out really, really well. It's very easy to use, very inexpensive. And they, they were around, it was like a as seen on TV thing I know, for I years. Yeah, I remember those yes. back in the day. And so they're if just, you want to clear out an area years years. that you want to plant something Yep, new. or if you just have a ton of weeds in an area. Yes. A lot of people just say, how do I kill like this whole area of weeds? And they don't, they want to reseed there quick. 
And you can use Roundup, but Roundup you know, takes about 15 days, right? Yeah, Not yeah. everybody loves to yeah, use we Roundup. Don't like that, no. You can go ahead and use this, right? Yes. You can use this or the, the product right next to it, that Garden Weasel Pro, right? So if you, How do you have use this guy, same that thing. One, yeah, that one just digs into the dirt and you just. You can fight turns, off an intruder right? with this. I mean, too. it looks cool. It has like a step in it, so you can push it down. So if you have big, big weeds that are just getting very large, right? Not just not just small weeds like that. You can dig down. The key with the weeds is you got to get the roots, mm -hmm. right? If you don't get the roots, they're just going to come I right know, back. I know. Right? I know. And it's, you could just keep it right by your bed stand, you know, near your yes. stand, and you can just, you know, and then use you're it. ready to yeah, go. Yeah, protection These too. I like nice it. These because they also don't take up a ton of space. I mean, this is like a small thing. Oh, yeah. It slides in the corner of your garage. It's not a huge apparatus. And when you felt that weasel product, I know this is going to sound weird to say the weasel products make really good products, but that felt fairly substantial, right? It's, it's substantial, but they're they're both actually pretty yeah, light. Yeah, this one, yeah, light, but it feels yeah, like a good tool, right? This one's light, and this right? one's light, too. And, yeah. and this one feels like this is something you'd have forever, Like right? they're made really well. You, you buy yeah. one, and that's it. That's great. This well, you one, always say, like, the price on a hose, Mike always says, like, there's a reason yeah. why there's cheap hoses. That's right. You buy the best hose, and it lasts, you know, they don't four last, years yeah. instead right. of two years. Mm -hmm. Right. All right. I'm a little confused on what this is. What is this? This is uh, my nickname in high school, <laughs> Action Ho. <laughs> I didn't know if I was going to do that, but I thought it was so good. I just I'm glad you said it. Um, I made a it. joke. And it is, it, this blade is sharp, right? So don't yank it out of I the hands. I won't, yeah. Um, as you work that into the ground, it just goes right down and cuts the weed below the ground, oh. right? And you work back and forth, a little action to it. And it, instead of like digging with a shovel out, or taking a big weeder that you have to, you know, take a swing at it. Yeah. You work that right into the ground and just walk through the, the weeds. And you won't do that in the grass area. You do that in your flower beds. You can mm -hmm. do that where you have mulch with weeds growing through mulch. Yep. And you kind of get through and past the mulch. The mulch is up above and you're below and you're just yeah. cutting the weeds oh, right that's I have smart. a side yard area that I feel like this is the this is the trick here you, that I You know need. what I'm going to do today is your lucky day. Anything you want on this <laughs> table is yours. Take yeah, she's torch. like take the burning take torch. The torch. Yeah. Jay has yeah. yeah. those flamethrower things that yeah. lights up. I know, all isn't that so cool? He uses it to light the fire in the house and I'm like, oh "Wait, my. what?" Talk to okay. him later. Yeah, don't put that on I'm Facebook sure or knows. anything, because that, yeah. or don't talk about it on like live TV. <laughs> like, I don't, I don't, oh, by the way, I want to I want to thank you because the last time you were on, you were talking about the lawnmower. Yes, I went to one of your stores and bought one. Oh, fantastic! Did you get the electric? I got the electric yeah. and I got okay. the smaller one because yeah. you got the Mac yes. Daddy yeah, one yeah, here. Yeah, 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 I got the smaller one because I got a smaller one. And they're so great. It's right? awesome. They're absolutely so great. And yeah, I you can talk just like this when you're running it. It's so cool. So yeah. good. Yeah. Okay, Mike is the best. Fratelloni's Hardware and Garden has 22 locations across Minnesota. We posted a link to their website on TwinCitiesLive.com.